Alright, welcome back to another round of Pokemon Fire Red. So when we left off, we we're about to go on this nice little bike ride, and of course our bike is just, uh, you know, randomly spinning around, as uh, bikies are wont to do. So what the hell, let's just randomly battle them, shall we? Okay, hand it over. Nah, I don't think so. Besides that, I think they've got, they've got better bikes anyway. Better than a push bike. But whatever. Of course they want more. They always want more, don't they? Those gritty bastards. Anyway, let's just uh, see if we can. There we go. Rock their worlds, maybe. Quite literally, with an earthquake. And down they go. <laughs> Alright. Should, should I switch them out? Change Pokemon. Mm, no, but. Oh no, that's right. Fighting is. I don't think it's super effective against ground, so I think we should be alright. Oh my god. Just as well, because he's going to get another shot off. Okay. Oh, that was a critical hit as well. Oh, indeed. Focus energy. Meh. See if I can. I mean, really focus energy. Oh, now it does magnitude 8. <laughs> Outstanding. Okay, he'll get up there eventually. Now yeah, let's actually have a look. So he's level 33, 33... Yeah, they're all 33 actually. So... Yeah, screw it. I suppose he can remain there. Okay. Yes, yeah, so if one thing doesn't work, you keep trying more of it, basically. Seems to be the mantra that pretty much all the uh, Pokemon trainers in this game have. Oh, really? Oh, that doesn't sound good revenge. Oh, I see. Oh well, let's cut him down to size. There we go. Cue ball, really. Knockout. Damn straight at this. Well, I'll probably have to end up healing them after this, but that's alright. Yeah, let's see. Should just do that now, actually. Now squad's battle a few more, then we'll do it. Alright, so Saga Boy, why not actually? Fight fire with fire, I say. Although I reckon the next one I go to will probably have something completely different, but we shall see. Okay, yep. Little mouse, eh? Just like uh, The Secret of Nim. Damn good movie. But anyway. And what do you know? A monkey versus a monkey. Yeah, let's see. So Seismic Toss apparently uh, does damage equivalent to the enemy Pokemon's level, I think that's what it was. Uh, so wait a minute, if I try that... How much damage will that actually do you here? Okay, decent amount. What about brick break? Wow. Okay, not that. <laughs> A chop? Nah, I don't think so. Of course, I'm just gonna have fighting type Pokemon. It's about I don't have any psychic types. Oh well. Bam. Oh, come on, really? Oh, for fuck's sake, and revenge. Ugh. Oh, well, that's what I'll just finish him off of that. <laughs> See how he likes that. Yeah, and that's all she wrote. A little rat. A rat on the mat. Alright. Never claimed to be anything more, as someone say. But anyway. Face. Of course, rat's being totally quiet anyway, so there you go. <laughs> hey, you just bumped me. Did I now? Well, heaven forbid. Oh god, the freaking poison bastard. Ugh. This is gonna be fun. Yeah, let's see, I suppose... Brick Break again, why not? I keep forgetting about that same type attack bonus as well. I'm not very effective either. Yeah, screw it. We'll deal with that, I suppose. Okay, I guess Mega Kick then. Just so that we got that off of Fax. Like, Oh my god, he's not going to be able to hit a thing after that. Ugh. Come on, oh my god, he's just going to keep missing. And he's going to get poisoned. Yep. Come on, Slugger Boy, what the hell do you call that? Alright, just one kick, that's all I'm asking. Yes. Will that actually one hit him though, that is the question. Not quite. And down he goes. Yeah, well, he tried. God knows he tried. So actually, is water effective against poison? One would think not, but you never know. Let's see. God, I really wish they could wrap up 
from top to bottom, but what can you do? Alright, so water. Okay, it's effective. Super effective against fire, ground, and rock. Half against water, grass, and dragon. Alright, well, no particular specialty either way. Alright. Yeah, let's see. Why not send him out? Do it for Porion. Get to the chopper. Why the hell did I do that? Oops. <laughs> I was kind of hoping it'd flinch at least, but noop. Now, yeah, well, let's finish him off with a quick attack then. Outstanding. Oh, and a critical hit. I wonder if that was actually necessary. Well, in any case, he's up to level 34, so he's happy. Okay, well done, Vaporeon. Defeated Hideo Kojima by the looks of things. Outstanding. Now I'm taking on Laika, taking to the million from Fuchsia, going on coast. Two of a million from Fuchsia. Interesting. Million Fuchsia. Okay, what what about this route then? Don't you knew? So can we actually reach this without having to use Surf then? I guess we'll find out. Well, for the time being though, I think we'd better get ourselves healed up once again though. <coughs> if they let me love, ride my uh, bike indoors. It's nice of them, uh, and there we go. Where the hell is the Poker Center? I think it was top right, wasn't it? Yep. Yeah. Oops. Ugh. There we go. Huh. Yeah, there we go. Bit of a rough start to our little adventure, but uh, yeah, we'll get through it bit by bit. Old sports. <coughs> yeah. Hmm. Yeah, so I'm just wondering what exactly is down this bike track. We're we just going to get plenty of bike keys, or we're actually going to get. Uh, Something more substantial. Maybe we can actually catch Pokemon as well, God forbid. Who knows? Who knows? And we'll also have to remember the gatehouse upstairs section has a um, one of Professor's aides that uh, talk to him. Yep. That um, has an amulet of some description. Okay, just gonna catch one more Pokemon, I think, for that. Now there. Let's have ourselves a good try. No, not with you, I don't think. But anyway. But we can battle Pokemon, though. <laughs> but anyway. And of course, another freaking Weezix. So you can probably imagine this is going to end. <laughs> uh, I guess. Mega Q, then, I guess. Yeah. Pitch, Kumatrino. It's better than nothing. Now, is he going to get poisoned? That is a question. Oh, of course. Got freaking poison types. Love how he gets hurt in the same turn, so. Oh, well, at least it should be able to two shot him pretty easily. Yep. Yep. And yes. Coughing. And. Can actually take another shot? He might be able to. I'll give it a shot anyway. Might even be able to one shot him, actually. Oh, for fuck's sake, come on. And he's only using tackle anyway. Brilliant. Jesus Christ, just let me level him up. There we go. Uh, not quite, not quite. And now he's gonna be missing all sorts of shots. Oh well. Okay, we just need to be able to make one more shot, I think. We should be fine. Let's so use a brick rank. Oh, wait a minute, it's not very effective though. Oh shit, I completely forgot about that. But it still worked. <laughs> Outstanding. And. I guess we better change Pokemon then. Yeah, well. <coughs> Can't get enough of that noise. Alright. Thank god it stopped. Alright. Yeah, of course, not wheezing. God, they really love those things, don't they? Cheap bastards. Well, let's see. Thunderbolt, I suppose. Will that be effective? Actually, probably won't really do anything special against them. Well, that's not bad either, though. And he's gonna get poisoned as well, because why wouldn't he? Poisons, or maybe not. Well, there you go. <coughs> yep. Don't make me mad. No, it made me plenty madder enough by having to get my Pokemon back to the Poker Center. Let's see, go. Okay, 
race against time. Nope, guess not. <laughs> ah, well, at least that gets rid of the annoying sound if nothing else. Yep. Yeah, so there we go. Good old Pokemon. I think they're coming up with new... I can't remember. Pokemon games or some, some description as well for one of those Nintendo handhelds. I can't remember which one. Maybe it's the 3DS, maybe it's some other thing. <laughs> but there we go, there's that to look forward to. So Probably won't be playing it anytime soon, but you never know. Actually, not won't be, if I'm being honest. Anyway, I get my key experiencing people plus Pokemon. Indeed. Yeah, one more. Okay, well, let's rock. Cameron. Interesting name. Oh my god, more monkeys. Why not? At least I don't have to worry about my guy getting poisoned, if nothing else. Yeah, let's see. Quick break then, I guess. <clears throat> okay. Apparently, uh, Seismic Toss is good against wild Pokemon for catching them, because they don't, uh, you don't ever get a critical hit from that, so I suppose that's better than nothing. Actually, I might as well just keep him out, why not? Just give him more experience. Even though I think we've still got a, another 30, level 34, no, 33 guy to level up, but uh, yeah, it's all good. Just keep him out here anyway. So, when is Slugger Boy actually going to evolve, though? Oh, for God's sake. Well, could be worse. <coughs> What will we actually evolve into, though? What will he evolve into, should I say? Anyway, bad for him. Ah, well, managed to mug him at least. Okay. Indeed. But what do you know? Maybe I'm, I'll be able to actually make it. Wait a minute, can't I? Ah. Oh. Interesting. Little trade lane they've got there. Alright, well, let's switch out the Pokemon, uh, just in case. Ah, here we go, yep, 33 still. Outstanding. Oh, no, actually, wait, there's one more, actually. Digger, of course. That. Well, well, well. What the... No, I... What the hell's... I'm... Why does it do that? Really? So I have to go... Ugh. God. Damn. Whatever. I mean, that, that's the bike going down its own there. Yeah, that's what it was doing before. Yeah, well, at least we get a bit more experience for our electric tank here. Outstanding. <coughs> yep. Yeah. Wow. One shot, not that. And that's all she writes. Yeah, why not? So get good old Tigger out. God, this bike is just right, riding around doing nothing. Gotta love it. Oh, my champ is actually slightly worse. That should be fine. She'll be right, mate. At the very least, we're not a stone type, or rock type, should I say, which I'm pretty sure is weak to fighting. Hopefully, ground is not. We'll find out. Okay, that was a critical hit. Wasn't even super effective. Oh my god. Oh, uh, alright. Yeah. Actually, yeah. Send you out. Jesus, that freaking champ. Alright. Well. Might as well go for the finisher, I suppose. Alright, well, I suppose I'll get plenty of experience, if nothing else. Yep. <coughs> Woo. Yes, one dude. God. Look at that. As soon as I get my hand off of that, it just goes straight down. I mean, what if I want to go into this patch here? Well, it's... Yeah, it'll still get me to go down like that. I didn't even check to see what Pokemon had out. So in any case, I'd captured Do Do Duo already, so... Oh, it's Tyson saying. Yeah, whatever, we might as well one-shot him. Actually, maybe we can catch another... Pokemon so we can get that amulet, whatever it does. M super effective, Huzzah. Flying type Pokemon that can't fly. I mean, look at that. Why does it just get me to keep going down like that? It's just ridiculous. Now, yeah, well, go just insane. Hopefully, we're going to get more than just these freaking mundane types. 
I mean, experience is fine and all, but I just want to catch one more. Come on. Okay, yep, yep. <clears throat> and another Dojo. Great, some mundane types. Probably should check to see what Pokemon actually spawn on this bike trail. Honestly, I wasn't actually expecting any wild Pokemon at all, but there we go. That's what we managed to get. Should probably interfere with um, shipping traffic traffic having this sort of land route, but there you go. Oh, no. Adorable little Raditz. Too bad I've already got a better version of that. Oh well. Down you go. Uh, more spirits. Yeah, something tells me we're not going to be getting another unique Pokemon off of this patch of ground. A patch of grass. Yeah, a bit of experience goes a long way, but still, I mean, these guys are pretty under level, really. Yeah, well. <laughs> Come on. Oh, what do you know? Eradicate. Actually having an evolved version. No, good for them, good for them. <clears throat> Down you go, even managed to take a hit, look at that. I suppose I'd expected nothing else from such a mighty rat. What the hell was that? Orenberry, really? Oh, for God's sake. Oh, whatever, I'll just finish him off with that. Easy. Okay, well, we might actually be able to get something, maybe. Maybe an evolved version of another, another Pokemon already captured. Maybe a, a Fero. The evolved version of this Spiro. That would be nice. Okay. Yep, 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 come on. Super effective. God, you've got to have the amount of chance involved in this. Ha, <laughs> they sort of series became incredibly... Whoa, what the hell is that? Oh, it's a Fero. Speak of the devil. Yeah, no wonder this series, um, game series became so popular, really, when there's an element of chance involved there. Uh, yeah, people tend to react far more strongly to rewards that are uncertain, rather than to rewards that are consistent. So that's something to keep in mind. Anyway, yeah, let's go for Thunderbolt, actually. Hopefully we won't one-shot him. Let's see. Yeah, we'll one-shot him, alright. <laughs> Oops, you Alright, go test and tank. Alrighty. I suppose... Slam that will have to do. Okay... Oh my god, that was a critical hit either. Okay, what if it wasn't a critical hit? Would we actually be able to... Get him down to very low health in one shot? Let's see. Really? Getting a critical hit every single time? I mean, it's great that it's actually happening at all, but... Uh, don't really want it to happen this particular time. Okay, that's... Could be, it could be worse. Okay, well, let's try... There we go, just in case, just try a quick attack. Okay, there we go, perfect. Pursuit. Just as all that's completely useless unless if you're fleeing. Anyway, let's give this a shot, then old sports. I suppose at some point we'll have to get a paralysis move or a sleep move to uh, make them easier to catch. But not today, hopefully. Okay. Come on. There we go. Huge and magnificent wings can keep it aloft in the sky. It can remain flying a whole day without landing. Incredible. Captured Fear, eh? Uh, yeah, why not? Let's see. Suppose. Make. Oops. See, long I did that unnecessarily. Make 35. Okay, I probably never 
end up using him, but you never know. I have to just go through it a couple more times just to make sure there's nothing else I missed, and yeah, then I think we'll get our stuff filled up. Why not? Oops, yeah, he likes some of that, you bastard. Perfect. Okay, there we go. It's about the time we actually caught something worthwhile like that here, right? Alright, anything else? Nope, just a duo. Ah, well. Maybe there's an evolved version of that in the grass somewhere, you never know. Just never know. Okay, well, in case that was super effective. Bizarre. Alright. Oh, for fuck's sake. Ugh. Alright. Yeah, I mean, look at that. I mean, clearly it's not as if my button's broken. Because it's not going continuously down, it's just staying there. Ugh. Alright, fine. Now then. Uh, oh, that's right, he's fainted. Damn it. Well, why not switch you out? Okay. And I think there was one guy around here. I might as well battle him before going back. Yep. Heading to Fuchsia? Maybe. What's it to you? I mean, really, where else is this path going to lead? Anyway, whatever. Oh my god, another Weezing. Ugh. Alright, here we go again. <laughs> no, I have to admit, it's not uh, such a bad move, actually. Just as well that uh, he's not getting poisoned, that'd be a pain in the ass. Here we go. Oh, very decent experience, actually. And you. Bit of a shame how we don't have old uh, digger outs. Be absolutely perfect to level up off of these guys. That's that. Uh, well, I think he's still level 33. I think so. Well, in case he's down. Okay, yep, yep. And no. Just kind of wish it wouldn't auto control my bike when I'm on the trail. That's there you go. I mean, making it move faster. That's that's great and all, but making me move. In one particular direction, unless I hold the mouse in the other direction, now that's a pain in the ass. Now, well, and of course, missed. We're going to get into the uh, miss loop now, by the looks of things. There we go. Okay. Perfect. Well, I'm pretty sure that uh, Digger is definitely not at uh, level 35, that's for sure. Crash and burn. Indeed. Feel the burn, as it's were. Ugh. Ridiculous. I mean, what if I want to go back from Fuchsia to, uh... Oh, that's right, to Selden. Of course, I can just uh, use Fly. There we go, that's better. Oh, actually, I might as well collect our little amulet. Yes, yes. Alright. Amulet's coin. Yes. What? Oh fuck, I thought I had 39. Oh, pitch fucking matty. God. Well, hopefully that amulet coin is not critical or anything. Also, you can't just give it to me, can I? Oh well. well. I guess I have to catch a few more then. I'm kind of surprised I haven't caught more already, actually. I mean, I've pretty much been exploring every uh, bit of wild terrain that uh, I've come across. I suppose I haven't really been evolving um, Pokemon ex except the ones I wanted to actually use long term, so I suppose there is that, but still, I mean, we had the uh, Raticate and the Fero there, the evolved versions of the other Pokemon available, so yeah, screw it. Yeah, well, let's try that again, shall we? <coughs> still not really sure if I agree with this mechanic, but whatever. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. Let's battle you. I forgot to switch out the Pokemon. Whoops. Electrify. Oh, for fuck's sake. No. No, no, no. Let's send out all Digger, actually. There we go. <clears throat> so there's the main route, and there's this little side route as well. Oh, and there's this guy here, which I... Indeed. Which I completely forgot about. Huh. Alrighty, well I guess we'll battle him first, then. 
back. Shit, no problem there. Oh, for fuck's sake, come on. Hopefully it doesn't have revenge or anything like that. No, oh, there we go. <laughs> Outstanding. Well, that's slightly better, but still. Jesus. Oh, there we go, that actually worked. Good. Primate? No, I don't think so. Okay. Oh, maybe that's actually what I've got, it's the Primate. It's kind of hard to tell looking at it from behind, but there you go. I'll probably get one shot. Almost, almost. The open is seismic toss. Thankfully, it doesn't do, do that much damage, unless if you got really high level. Oh, that, then again, that is quite a bit of damage, though. Hmm. Indeed. Oh, now it gives a magnitude 8. If I had that at the beginning, I probably would have been able to one shot it. Oh. There you go. Okay. Burned out. Outstanding. Now, now it's time to take out the uh, electric guy. Now, oh, for God's sake. There we go. Let Voltorb electrify you. Well, they can try. They can certainly try. Okay. Back on Nicholas sent out to Voltorb. Outstanding. The oversized Pokeball. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. He's got freaking Levitate. No, he doesn't. Oh, there we go. Oh, no, it's the ghost types that have that, I think. But anyway, super effective. Not so bad. And... no, I don't think so. Outstanding. There we go, now we're getting some good magnitudes. Biker, Biker cannot comprehend the magnitude of Digger's awesomeness. Something like that. Alright. Grounded out, indeed. Yeah, quite literally, in fact. Well said, old sports. Okay, power plant, thanks for letting me know. Actually, what is that sign there? Well, I guess we'll eventually find out. Jesus, why did they implement this this way? Such a pain in the ass. Okay, all the roads, yeah, don't you? Interesting how the hair is pink there, but uh, the actual portrait here is brown for the hair. Interesting. Well, there you go. Oh, this is going to be an interesting little battle. Hopefully we can get a good magnitude. Yeah, it could be worse. Just have to hope he doesn't get poisoned. Okay, well... Oh, super effective, but not bad. Antagonist. <laughs> Out. Freaking standing. Yeah, let's see... Dig, why not? Hopefully he's not going to do any self-help moves. Okay, we'll try that instead. And there we go. Finish him off with that, why not? Very nice. Actually, wait a minute, what type is that muck then? Oh, too late to check now. Oh, well, I might check afterwards then if I remember. So we've got that, we've got uh, how many more of these branching paths are going to have, I wonder? Oh, here we go. To notice, watch out for discarded items. Okay. Like that one there, or is that a lamppost? Okay. Yeah, whatever. Wait, oh no, that's actually something there. Oh no, that's just a damn lamppost. And a biker. Alright. New problem, eh? <clears throat> wow, he's actually loaded. Oh, this should be interesting. Oh, why not? I guess we'll do that. Yeah, not bad. Well, actually, we could just fly back to Seldon City, presumably from the path here. Without having to ride the bike all the way back there. Makes a bit more sense. Thank you. Now we'll just keep the uh, ground train moving here, shall we? Yep, that could be worse. <coughs> well, thanks for feeding me experience, old sports. Uh, I think you can take them on. Oh, right. Well, this is going to be interesting. Let's see if this will work. Oh, for fuck's sake. I love the randomness of that. Well, it could be worse. Oh, Revenge is going to suck, though. I think he's going to go down. He certainly is. 
Yeah, well, old Digger just can't catch a break, can I? Guess we use Sniper Boy, why not? Fire with fire and all that. Alright. Oh, wait a minute, I should have gone there now. And it didn't even work anyway. Great. Well, thanks for doing a do nothing move, essentially. <laughs> there we go, at least that worked. Yep, perfect. No. no too bad I didn't, uh... <laughs> too bad I didn't have, um, dig around for that. What can you do? Good workout, indeed. Now, have you got anything useful to say? Oh. God's sake. Ugh. Uh, okay. Alright. Yeah, mate. Alright. Just go down here, actually, just to see if there's anything important. I don't think so. Future City, and... I don't think there's anything here, just all notices. Oh, this is meant to be a slope, is it? Oh, okay. B button. Oh. Okay. That's good to know. Now, for fuck's sake. Oh, right, so then there's that. Okay. Well, no problemo, let... There we go, let's just do that, and fly the hell out of there so we can get old Digger healed up again. <laughs> well, that is convenient, I'll say that much. How the hell is that meant to be a slope, though, if it's over the water like that? I mean, are we supposed to believe that there's a massive slope going over the water? I mean, really? It just seems very strange. Of course, I so there's nothing of the uh, creatures that I'm catching, and those are rather strange as well, but anyway, there we go. <clears throat> and back we go. Hmm. Quaint little bike path. Bit of a pain in the ass how I keep getting guys fainting, but that's alright, it's good exercise for them, I can say. Anything here to be found? Let's find out. And nope, just a giant rat. Oh well. I suppose it's better than nothing. No freaking quick attack though. Oh well, we'll train him up if nothing else. He'll probably end up fainting again before we reach freaking fuchsia, but we shall see. Really? Why not, say? Eh? Why not? And... I'm gonna shoot again. Why not? Oh, there we go. Now we can just make it freaking nine. Have to work on your timing, Digger. Those magnitudes. Ah uh, well. <coughs> and more the same. Why not? Okay. Well, I guess we'll just do that again. Hope for the best. Oh, for fuck's sake! Could do a decent magnitude at the right time to save his life. It seems. Oh, that does not look good at all. What does it actually do? Speed, of course. So we'll probably get the, uh, yep, we'll get the speed advantage. I don't know why he's doing that again, though. But why not? Just to hammer his home. And what's it going to be? There we go. Reckon if he did that at the beginning, yeah, we've got a one shot like before. Now, oh, there you go, took that bastard down. Perfect. Try riding down here and see where this leads us. We already talked to him. Thanks for the tip. Ah, here we go. Won't evolve why? Probably because you suck, that's why. Suck so much your Pokemon won't even evolve on you. You're stuck with a Machoke. For all time. I thought that was the evolved version of that other thing, but apparently not. Interesting. Alright, whatever. Let's just take it out nonetheless. Oh, actually, speaking of which. Let's see, so ground type versus whatever the muck was. So fire, electric points. Oh, of course, the muck must be poison. Alright, electric poison, rock and steel. Oh, okay, those really do well against rock as well. And steel. Alright, that against flank. Alright, good. 
Oh my god, that freaking revenge move. I can't get enough of that. Pfft, incredible. Yes, come on, take you out. There we go. Yep, yep. I wonder how long this freaking bike track is. Why you? Why you little? Zed. That. Yep, maybe, maybe. Now then. Let's switch you out and we've got a level 34, yep. Perfect. We have to end up flying back anyway, but we shall see what happens. Just save that. Alright. Be a rebel. I'm trying on spawn. Huh, this path seems to diverge from the other one actually. Now there we go. Why not say? Eh? Why not? I should be able to win by sheer virtue of higher level, but uh, you never know. Especially if they use freaking moves like Seismic Toss. At least you won't get a critical hit from that. Okay, and why not to scratch just like a little bit? Bam. See how you like that. Okay, and nah, screw it. God, he's probably going to use freaking Revenge on me. Take him out in the next uh, shot, but you never know. Maybe we'll be able to one shot him. Let's see. Nope. And Foresight, alright. A do-nothing move, as far as I can tell. Let's see. Okay, we just use Seismic Toss just so I can retain some PPs and the other stuff. And there we go. <laughs> Outstanding. Cross Chop, eh? Yeah, why not? I don't even know what that is, but we'll find out. So, actually, Seismic Toss. Matching the user's level. Oh, the user's level, not the uh, the foe's level. Whoops, must have misread that. This is damage matching the user's level. Alright, so that's actually is going to improve as he um, levels up then, very nice. But then again, I mean... Damage matching... Ech, apparently it's good against wild Pokemon for catching, so screw it. Alright, the foe's hit with double chops, it is a high critical hit ratio. Presumably each chop does 100 power damage, whatever. Okay. Okay, scratch. 40, 100, 120, 75. Ah, damn it. This is never too bad either. Should I just get rid of that actually? I mean, it's not like this if I don't have other moves that are good for catching wild Pokemon. I mean, you know, ones that do less damage. So just scratch, maybe, if I really want to keep that. It's high big. I mean, it's nice to have it as a normal move, just in case. Hmm. Critical hit ratio 180. Seismic toss. I mean, what level can they really get up to? I mean, level... Crap, I'm not sure what the actual level cap is. Is it le level 100? I mean, if it is then, then... I mean, this thing is also 100 though, so... Matching user's level, or is it meant to be more than the user's level? It doesn't seem to be particularly good. So what to do, what to do? And it's only 5 PPs as well, actually. I should have taken notice of that for the cross chop. This is pretty good at breaking barriers, which I'll probably will have to do at a later point. That's a pretty powerful move too. Seismic Toss Scratch. Hmm. I suppose we got normal just in case. Scratch is not that great. Alright, I'll get rid of freaking Scratch. I don't want him to have all fighting moves though, so I'll have to retain at least uh, Power Punch, whatever it's called. Yep. Earned Cross Chop Huzzah. Ah. And like how he's just. He, he, he must have just been patiently waiting for me to choose the move him to forget and all that, but anyway. Yep. Alright, I think this just leads me to the same, yeah, same thing anyway. Alright. Throw Pokeballs instead. Okay, why not, eh? How's it handle? Bad as well as can be expected, actually. Now then. Okay, what has he got? Oh no. Yeah, that's going to be the death of my uh, Slugger boy, that's for sure. Unless... let's try the cross drop out. 
critical hit. Oh, I thought it actually would do two hits. Whoops. And it's still not very effective anyway. <laughs> uh. I think it's still more powerful than Seismic Tosser. Though. Seismic Tosser presumably will get really powerful um, as he levels up. So I have to double check maybe the Bulbapedia as to how that actually works. For the time being though, let's use... Jeez, there's not many PPs at all. Alright, Seismic Tosser, I guess. Why not? <clears throat> Outstanding. And... No, let's keep using him until he goes down. Okay. Well, this is probably as good as it's going to get. So I could just use Mega Kick, actually, seeing as it's going to be... Well, Cross Chop is not going to be that effective. Oh, actually, no, wait a minute. Was it because he was part flying? Let's try Cross Chop again, actually. Okay, not very effective. Fine. And I probably shouldn't have quick saved on that slot now that I think of it. Whoops. Oh, well. Oh, for fuck's sake. No, fuck it. Just do your damn attack. There we go. That's slightly better. And, yep, here comes the poison. Mm-hmm. Oh, for fuck's sake. Just hurry up and die. There we go. Ah, oh, Jesus. Yep, he's gone down. Yeah, well, can't say we didn't try it. Great. Yeah, let's see. I suppose Digger... Yeah, why not? I suppose at least he's got super effective moves against... Oh, and of course, now he's got magnitude line. Again, it would have been great to have that at certain other points, but whatever. It gets the job done. That's uh, what counts. That. Shoot. Indeed. Ugh. So, how far away are we, actually? From, uh, Fuchsia City. Hmm. we still got this entire segment to go. Yeah, I think we should just fly back, actually. Where we go. The Charizard that apparently looks like a bird when it's flying. Sort of a bluish blackish bird there. Shape shifting Charizard, my god. It's a hidden ability. Maybe I'll see it in battle. But anyway. Still there, yep. Let's keep going. Yeah, so there we go. Pretty sure I'm well past the point when they um, stopped playing the game so long ago, so this is all going to be new to me, so that should be pretty fun. Okay, there we go. Interesting, I mean, they've got a gate keeper and all that, who'd let in all these bikers. I mean, I suppose maybe they came in the other way, but presumably there's going to be a gatehouse in the other... Oh, you actually already talked to him, battled him. Um, yeah, probably going to be another gatehouse in future anyway, so, yeah. Okay, yep. And we've got another guy to battle. Why not? I'm bushed. Yeah, who cares? He'll battle anyway. Okay, my god, actually getting a bit of a compliment of Pokemon out. Oh, for fuck's sake, not this again. Ugh. Well, I guess Mega Kick, why not? Still wouldn't mind leveling up Slugger Boy, but this might not be the best time to do it. Still, there, if he keeps one shotting like this, it's not too bad. Yep. Wheezing. Yes, I think we shall. Everyone's at 35. I guess we might as well get Digger to level up then, seeing as he's so super effective against these bastards. Okay. God, poison types are so annoying. Alright. Well, let's see what Bangladesh he's going to bring out. So, of course, the shitty one to begin with. Oh, he's the one with Levitate. Of course. Um, I wonder if we can actually uh, out damage him, maybe not. Come on, there we go, and this actually could still work. God, that levitates annoying though. Oh wait, no, he's still using sludge, but 
Oh, that was a critical hit. And not very effective. Oh my god, he's still gonna die anyway because of that critical hit, I bet. And because he keeps missing these attacks for some reason. Interesting. Okay. Come on. There we go. And of course, he'll keep getting his attacks on me. Outstanding. That's one more. Yes. Of course, Weezing must be part flying in that case. Okay, and yeah, I suppose we will. Hmm. Why not? Okay. Oh, I still got three more. Oh, my God. Oh, well, at least this will do some damage. So, wait, does, is he part flying as well, that coughing? I mean, it looks like he's levitating. Almost like one of those bombs from uh, Abe's Odyssey, actually. Whoops, no. You know, the little bits of metal sticking out, although in this case it's like little bumps that he's got with uh, pores or whatever you want to call them. So, he can get his gas out. Now, there we go. Down it goes, nonetheless. I'll also just keep sticking of old man Porian. God, that thing does not look happy, that's for sure. <laughs> see if we can put it out of its misery then. Okay, yeah, almost, but no cigar. Hmm. Let's eat. Okay, I guess quick attack should be able to do it, yep. And down you go. Ha. Outstanding. Are you satisfied? Thoroughly. Except for the fact that my guys have to heal up again. But anyway, yeah, let's see, Slinger 35. Yeah, might as well keep him out, I suppose. Don't think we'll bother trying to get them healed up again just yet. And I came from there. Alright. Wait, did he just reset, re reset position? Huh. Interesting. Alright. Yeah. Let's see how much further the rabbit hole goes on. Whoops, damn it. Ugh. Wait a minute. Ah, there we go. I forgot about that. Stoke pen's here. Ah, okay. Well, that's a bit of a relief. So we're going to encounter here, I wonder. It looks like we should be able to sort of shimmy between the fence and the coast there, but I suppose not. A few places to surf. Not yet, so. And I think we've only got a crappy fishing rod, if I remember correctly. I remember. And uh, let's see. Old, old rod, old amber, everything else. Alright. Loads of old stuff. No pedestrians permitted. Okay, and we got a bunch of weirdos there too. Yep. It mm -hmm. certainly is. Alright. Whoops, no. Okay. Huh. I don't think I actually have one. Oh. No, I do not. I thought I was actually going to, you know, try to automate that and look at through all my boxes and all that, but... Nope. Really not. Power town. Swimming. Garrett. There we go. So close to home, yet so far. That's... Well, it might as Battle these weirdos. Wow, they actually got pretty long uh, sight range. Grass area for new Pokemon. Yep, it's a good idea, isn't it? Birds. Great. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, what did I have? Ah, fighting type. That's going to be particularly effective. That's right, we do have Mega Kick, if nothing else, but uh, something tells me all these guys are going to be freaking bird keepers then. Okay, well, actually, he's doing decently well. But yeah, better change over just in case. Okay, 55. Yep, alright, time for Tesla Tank to shine. <laughs> Imagine using electricity as anti air. <laughs> Wacky concepts. That being said, though, they did um, have an interesting example of, I think, oops, didn't need to touch the microphone. <laughs> an interesting example of, um, of electric cannons, or whatever they were meant to be, lightning cannons, in. Uh, Touch I think it was called. Was it. Was that game that had Hellgast in it? Dead something? Kill Zone, that's it. 
Yes, yeah, so it had an, an, an anti-air lightning cannon. Brilliant. Anyway, this is my turf. Get out of the yard. No, I think I'll stay right here. Mr. Bird Keeper. Your crappy Spiros. Hopefully there's going to be more than that. This little patch of grass. Oh, right, I forgot to change the Pokemon. <laughs> well, maybe we can actually level him up in that case. Or uh, not. Is that going to be super effective? Yes, it is. Come on, we just need to get one single solid hit on him, for God's sake. Come on. There we go. <clears throat> Spiro, yes, you pet your ass, will. <clears throat> See, I never actually played... Oh, he's got three more. Um, I never actually played... Uh, what's it called? Kill Zone. It's, uh, I don't know, it just looked like another generic shooter to me. But I have to admit, though, that lightning cannon effect was pretty, uh, pretty fancy, to say the least. Anyway, down here, guys. I think they were using that... Oh, whoops, no. I think they used that on the uh, one of those open top transports. That was flying in in the, one of the opening sequences. I think that's where I remember it from. Maybe, maybe that was the trailer that I saw. Must have been. I mean, who the hell would use open top transports like that for an aerial assault? I mean, that just doesn't make any sense either, for that matter. And also, when they were shouting at another guy. That's just ridiculous. I mean, who needs to use radio, I suppose, though? Anyway, we'll battle whatever the hell this is. Fero? No, Spiro. Why not? And, uh, get rid of the bastard. Uh, outstanding. Indeed. Okay, yep, so I'm guessing there's gonna be there's gonna be plenty of birds here then. Okay, bird call it wasn't particularly convincing, but uh, that's right, just working at old sports. Oh what has he got? Oh Dodrio. Well I'll be damned, a Pokemon that I haven't actually caught yet. Oh my god, and I keep forgetting it um, about that. And uh, let's see, hopefully he won't take too much damage then. Whoops. Let's get the first hit off, but that's all right. Yep. No. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's good. Outstanding. All right, let's finish him off then. Pretty decent level, actually. He's got on it. Now I guess he's the final boss of the area, but still down. Outstanding, and enjoy the paralysis. Yes. I had to bug you. Fly, you fool. Anyway. Yep. Now, well, let's have a quick look in here, shall we? Oh, no, I forgot again to change my Pokemon out. Whoops. Ah, it's just a crappy one anyway. Alright, well, let's switch him out for the one that's not super effective. Maybe they pour out. There we go. <coughs> oh, for God's sake. Well, I suppose you might as well train up a guy as well, right? It's Let's see, Ward Pulse. We're probably going to have the same Pokemon here as that other patch of grass, I'm guessing. Now, yeah, well, could be worse. Yep, there we go. How many Pokemon are really supposed to be able to hide in this tiny patch of grass anyway? Oh, very impressive. Too bad I already caught him. <clears throat> oh, he's got the speed advantage? Seriously? He's almost 10 levels below me. Wow. Incredible. Yeah, well, could be worse though, he's only pecking at me essentially. Down guys, the giant sort of rooster, but sort of not really. At, at least, let's have a look to see if this is going to bring us anything. And up, same old. Yeah, I think it's just going to be the same old Pokemon actually. Yeah, well, that's right, at least we uh, gave it a shot, old sports. We should be able to le level up all the Vaporeon as well. Now look at that. Totally necessary. <laughs> Outstanding. Yeah, I think their maximum level is 100. Oh, Aurora Beam. Ooh, sounds fancy. Yes, I think we shall. So what is Aurora Beam? Oh, it's ice. That's very nice. 
Uh, actually, I'll just check to see what uh, ice is good against. I think it's good against dragon, if I'm not mistaken. Yep. So, yeah, doubly effective against grass. Really? Grass? Alright. Grass, ground, flying dragon. What an odd mix. Huh. And half effective against fire. Because it gets melted, I guess. Porter, ice, and steel. Alright, that's well. Worthwhile type though to have since I don't have any other ice types. Alright, so what is ice? Rainbow colored attack thing, but may lower the foe's attack stat. Okay, not bad, not bad, and we'll get rid of sand attack. Outstanding. Out. Actually, one more, one more just for the hell of it. Maybe I'll get lucky. Or maybe not. Oh well. What the hell actually? Let's give that a shot. Huh. An interesting effect. Yeah, it's critical hits and super effective. Has that. Okay. Yeah, well that's that for the bike path. Yep. Fusion City. Has that. The big city. So convenient to get to. Anyway, what about the gym? Koga, poison it. Oh my god, poison. You've got to be kidding me. An interesting setup for. Oh, I should have gone to the Poker Center first. And we've got something there. How am I even meant to get to that? I don't know. Maybe it's just there for decoration. Alright, yeah, so we might as well heal our guys up. And. Oh, why do I. Uh, Jesus. Okay, let's do that again and actually pay attention. Got a few houses. Actually, let's go on there first. Why not? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Oh, that's right. There's the uh, safari zone. Ransom. Blah, blah. Yeah, whatever. He's got to catch them all, does he? What about you? Move to later. Hmm. Nah. Okay, good to know though. Honestly, not sure. Not really sure why I'd want to actually do that though. I mean, why not just replace the moves as you go along? Oops, I'm not going down there though. All right, so that would be route 19, which would lead to somewhere. Let's see. Ah, here of course, which I'm assuming we're probably going to need to surf for this portion at least. Given that it's blue and this is not. Huh. Interesting. And we can go through the other path as well. Yeah, not bad. Oh, actually, I need to talk to these guys, of course. Yep. Safari. Alright, good. So, good hint. One would think it's pretty obvious given the name, but alright. Yep. Hmm. Viridian. Pokemon HQ, have I been there? I can't remember. Where is Viridian? <laughs> That's the question. Vermilion, Saffron, Saladon. Is this Viridian? No, this is Fuchsia. Cinnabar, Virid Ah, right, to that, yeah, of course. So we still need to visit power plant. Okay, there's that. There's this. Sea from islands. Yep, there's a few places left to visit, but yeah, I think we're we should be well past the uh, halfway mark at the very least. Outstanding. So, all oh right, that's what she said. All right, yep. Mm. Yes. And there you have it. We also got uh, poison type Pokemon to look forward to as well, which is just going to be fine and dandy, I'm sure. Like sour candy. We've got the uh, roots going down. Probably won't be able to go to it down too much. And let's see. Ah, yes, and there's the upper part there as well. 
Interesting arrangement they've got here, I'll say that much. Very interesting indeed. So there's a gym. Actually, let's just have a quick preview of that, why not? Okay. Invisible walls, oh my god. Oh, Jesus. Yep, that's how it's gonna be. So poison and invisible walls. Lovely. That well, I think we'll just save it there and uh, yeah. So that was the bike trail. Quite the uh, onerous trail indeed to say the least. Well what the hell managed to catch a Fero, so it wasn't all bad I suppose. Uh, yeah. Next time when we come back I will be exploring a bit of a future city, I suppose. I think that's where we are, yeah. Uh yes, yeah, so there we go. See us then.